Hey friends, it's Anya and welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I do have something special prepared. And by prepared, I mean I don't have anything special prepared, but I do have to prepare for a vacation that Christian and me are going on. If you want, you can guess in the comments down below where we're going. We're gonna celebrate our two year anniversary. Yay! I'm in packing mood right now because I do have to pack. Right now I came to the point where I need to pack my makeup and I have so much makeup. It's ridiculous. I can take all of it with me, although I wish I can. However, I do have some essentials that I believe you have to have or at least I have to have on the trips and I'm not talking about dance competition makeup because for that I would take much more than I'm taking right now so that's what I'm gonna show you today and if you're curious to see what are my essentials for this trip keep on watching guys I don't know if you can tell how excited I am no it's supposed to be a messy bun it's definitely messy I don't know if it's a bun but it's messy so Consider it a messy bun. Let's go. Quickly, before we even go into makeup, this is definitely not makeup, but I do love to use and I will be bringing this with me on this trip because the weather there where we're going is really hot and I do want to protect my skin from anything. So first thing that I'm obsessed with is this Watermelon Glow Ultra Fine Mist from Glow Recipe. This thing is amazing. It really hydrates your skin plus it smells so good. Another thing that I love using in the morning after I wash my face is Tatcha Dewy Skin Cream. I'm sure you heard of this before. Uh, it is really good. I personally love it. It is expensive, but I feel like it's doing its thing. So <laughs> I don't know. My skin feels so good after I put this on. And what I use at night before I go to sleep, and you can use in the morning too or at night, but I just like to alternate between these two. And that is Moisture Trip from Glam Glow. This thing is amazing. I don't know if you ever tried it. If you didn't, make sure to try it. I, you can go wrong with it. I feel it's for every type skin. Um, this particularly is more for my type skin, which is more on a dry side. This one on the other side, it's for everyone. So if you do want a good moisturizer, I do suggest this one. It's in a green color. I know they have different colors. This one is green. I don't know if the camera can pick it up. It's really, really good. So these three things are definitely going to be my essentials for my trip. Okay, now let's go on to the floor. Guys, this is the weird shot. I don't know how to do this. Should I just sit back on the table? Probably. But here's a quick, ooh. Here's the quick sneak peek of what are my essentials before I go back there. But that's gonna be like now, like in a second. Hey guys, I'm back. How do you like this angle? I'm currently like on my knees <laughs> uh, and I don't know why I'm not sitting on the chair and showing you like a normal person but it doesn't matter let's go into it so first what I will be using and bringing with me is mini travel size professional uh, primer for my foundations I'm gonna be bringing two things one is from Lancome skin feels good in shade blonde I believe yes and I personally love this one. It's a moisturizer with SPF 23. It's just tinted. But when we're gonna go out or something during the night maybe, I will be using my normal foundation um, from Maybelline Fit Me. After that, we do have to set with translucent powder and it's mini from Laura Mercier. I love minis for traveling especially. After setting our face, I will probably be using this bronzer from Rimmel. I love this one. I forgot one thing and that's concealer. This is my favorite concealer. It's Magic Star Concealer in shade C12. I, I love this one. At the end, I'm gonna use Morphe setting spray. Um, I don't know what to show you guys next. I still feel it's a lot of things. Anyways, next thing what I will bring with me is, I don't know if you saw my video where I did makeup or whole makeover for my mom. I use this Smashbox Full Exposure Palette. 
amazing palette, incredible palette, has everything you need from uh, mattes and shimmers. That I also use sometimes for my eyebrows. I'm gonna be bringing my Morphe uh, blush palette and I love this one because it has everything from coral to pinks to uh, deeper colors and these two I probably never used. But anyways, you know, you have an option if you want to. This is my highlight palette that I'm going to be bringing with me. You saw my review, right? Did you? No? I don't know. If you didn't, go check it out. Shade I usually use is this one called Gold Breaker in the middle. I really, really like it. However, all the others are really pretty. Too. Now, let's go on to two other eyeshadow palettes that I'm going to be bringing with me. First one, it's going to be Mini Breaker. If I do want to play with some colors, this one has it all. Not all, but a lot. This palette has quite some options for different colorful looks. However, I don't think I will be wearing that. I will probably go with nudes and more neutral tones. That's why I am bringing one of my other favorite palette that is called New Nude. It's from Huda Beauty. Another thing that I will be bringing with me for the first time ever, this little thing is gorgeous. It's in shade Amaze. I never ever had anything from Colourpop and I just got it a few days ago and this is the first time I actually tried it and I'm in love and I'm gonna definitely be bringing it with me. Before I go on to the lips, which is the majority of the stuff, I have a few things that I'm going to be bringing for my eye makeup. First off, I'm in love with this Morphe Coconut Eye Pencil, which I'm wearing right now. It goes in my waterline and it just makes your eyes look bigger. Another thing is my liquid eyeliner. I will be bringing two because I don't know in what mood I will be when I get there. They're both from Essence and one is super fine and it has this kind of applicator another one is super precise <laughs> eyeliner it's also long lasting and waterproof one more thing and that mascara i love this benefit mascara it's amazing my knees are hurting so bad and i don't know why i'm recording from this position i should just sit like a normal person but why would i anyways for my last step in my makeup routine which is lips I am bringing the most stuff and you may ask why and I really don't have an answer. I usually wear the same liquid lipstick from Jeffree Star and I don't know why this time it will be different but you never know so you bring more. I will be bringing a few pencils. I decided to take Too Faced Lip Injection. This Morphe, I'm not sure if it's a lip gloss or it's a lip lipstick liquid lipstick I feel like I feel like it's kind of in between another thing that I am lately obsessed with is Jeffree Star liquid lipstick in a shade fully nude from his new summer collection I like it because it is nude but it's not completely nude it has like a peachy undertone which is kind of fresh for summer so I really like that one I will be bringing this L'Oreal 422 liquid lipstick it's in between orange and red. And the last red that I will be bringing with me, which is, in my opinion, true red. It's from Fenty Beauty and it is in shade Uncensored. And guys, we're on to two last thing that I will be bringing with me. And one of them is thing that I wear right now. And it's this uh, little lip gloss or what do they call it? Yeah, glitter lip gloss. It's from Maybelline. It's in shade number 70. And the last thing, but certainly not least, is my Doug gloss from Jeffree Star in shade Shockwave. And when I decide to wear a lip gloss, I do love to wear this one. With all that being said, that is it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. And if you did enjoy watching this video and had fun, please give it a big thumbs up. If you're new here, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and ring that bell to get notified every single time I upload. And that's Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday. Have an amazing rest of the day and see you in the next one. Bye. Probably by the time the next video is up, I'm already gonna be back from my vacation. 
I don't want to go back. Wait, I didn't even leave and I'm already talking about coming back. What's wrong with me?